What's up my friends? Welcome back to another Cowie video brought to you in part by... Oh wait! <laughs> we haven't introduced this bike yet! Don't worry, we're getting to that part. It is a Harley Iron 883. And I know, I know, I know. It's, it's, you know, it's just you know, a little Harley 883, right? You know what? It's amazing. I love this bike. Ooh, caught a red. So I know I've been slacking a lot on the videos, guys, and it's not that I'm trying to. It's just, I've, you know, I've had a lot of things going on lately. Some important things, some non-important things, some depressing, shitty things, some good things, some bad things, you know, just life in general. But it's kind of taken me away from being able to vlog. I really need to do something with these mirrors. Oh, anyway, back to what I was talking about. You know, we'll get back to them soon. As for the videos, as long as I have a mobile bike, I'll be making them from now on. Now that we got this bad boy, or girl, I don't know yet, I, I don't know, it's temperamental, it's not temperamental, it cruises, it likes to cruise, it's a bitch, it's not a bitch, I, I haven't figured out a name yet, but we will, very, very soon, she's all murdered out, he, he, she, you know what, I'm just going to start calling it tranny, you know, my tranny's all murdered out, and uh, it's just, it's just, you know, a little black demon, oh yeah, speaking of cool stuff, check out uh, the new Brat Strap Kicks for Kids, Gloves, man, I love these things. I don't think I could ever ride anything else. They're so comfortable and just breathable. And I don't know, they're just nice. So nice. You know what? I think we're going to stop up on this road up here and do a little walk around on the bike for you guys. Let's check it out. All right, you guys. So here we have the 2014 Harley Iron 883. It's a little windy, so I hope uh, it's not too bad for you. Again, I bought I bought this bad girl right here, or boy. Uh, we haven't we haven't named it yet, okay? We're still working on a name, okay? But I bought it with 900 miles on it. I got a hell of a deal. The guy bought it new in 2014 from the dealership. He had a uh, 900 miles on it, and then he parked it. Look at that! Can you see that? Ooh! And up! Oh, I'm putting that many back on it. I found it on the Facebook Marketplace, and uh, he was only asking four thousand five hundred for it, but it needed a battery. So I went and bought a battery, and I got it for four thousand four hundred. The battery was a hundred bucks, but I mean, he paid twelve thousand dollars for this bike. Twelve thousand. How was I going to pass up this bike for four grand? You know, I honestly wanted a Dyna, but for four grand. Come on, no one would pass that up. That's stupid. Now, I know it looks dumb right now with the sissy bar on it. That's not always on there. Uh, we just been doing some riding lately or else it wouldn't be there. <laughs> I'm, I'm not a big fan of that. It looks ugly, but hey, it makes the rider on the back comfortable. So be it. Look at that, look at all the bugs. I haven't even, I haven't even got to clean it. Ugh. Nasty. <laughs> but yeah. That's the Harley that I just bought. So I also want to go ahead and shout out Voss, okay? Voss came through with this sick-ass 988 Moto helmet. I love it. I love it, love it, love it. Now look, look, look. You guys, wait, hold on. Wait, 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 wait. Let me get, let me fucking find it. Ah, I can't do it. I can't do it because my Cena thingy's in the way. Damn it. Bow. There we go. I'll be back. I feel like the fucking Terminator or Randy Savage wearing a big ass pair of Oakleys when I dropped this down. Like those old school ones, you know what I mean? Those really shitty fucking 90s, 80s ones. Yeah, that's what I feel like. But it's super chill, man. It's like vibrant, but it's still shady and allows the wind to continue to hit your face. And you gotta love that. But anyway, we're gonna put that back up. And uh, yeah, man, this, this, this helmet is amazing. I really recommend this, guys. Honestly, it's by far my favorite. I love the D2, don't get me wrong. When I'm riding, you know, on the DRZ or I'm on the stunt bike, the D2 just looks aggressive and cool as hell. It's also comfortable, but it's a little loose. But, I mean, the wind catches the visor or, you know, the, the little visor thingy up top. Yeah, the wind catches that. And with this, you don't have that problem. It is nice and comfy. I can wear it when I'm riding a Harley, and it still looks good. You know, I don't have to wear a half-face helmet, you know? I, I fucking hate those. You eat shit on one of those, what's gonna, your face is going to be gone. What the fuck? Those are so stupid. But anyway, guys, uh... 
Big shout out to Voss. Thank you so much for this uh, new helmet. I've got some more coming, guys, and I'll give you some uh, some shots of those whenever they come in. Uh, I'll do some more product reviews for them. But, um, yeah, you guys need to also go follow Careless, okay? My Careless fam, I would never rep a helmet without a Careless sticker on there. Why? Because I'm part of the Careless family, and you guys got to be part of that Careless family too, man. If you guys need some stickers or decals with the Careless Cowie Brock, get at me. Or if you just want to hit up Careless Original anyway, Go ahead and hit them up on Instagram or uh, I think it's careless.com, to be honest with you. And go ahead and order you some there, too. They will get them sent out to you uh, ASAP. They do not play when it comes to shipping. I do. I still got to fucking send out stuff for my 50K subscriber winner. And, uh, yeah, you know, you might as well just do that because uh, if you order them through me, it'll take forever. So go ahead hit them up. Go give them a follow. Go show them some love. You know, you got it. You got to. Just do it. Do it. So, yeah, anyways, we're going to go back. What? Uh, uh, Oh, I'm getting this every time. Blah, 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 blah. Woo! I love it. Fucking love it. Now, I can't do wheelies on it. It's not, it's, you know, people say you can, but I just, I can't. I've tried. It don't work. I just, I just can't do it. But I'm so careless. I'm going to do it again. Whenever I leave here, I'm going to try. I doubt it's going to work, but I'm going to try it. So anyways, guys, we're shutting this camera off and going back to the GoPro. And, uh, yeah, we'll holler at you later. Bye-bye. All right, guys, so we're back on the bike, and I, I know I just said I was going to try some wheelies. I really shouldn't, but, you know, I guess we'll do it. Whoa! I got it off the ground a tiny bit. I just don't know how much you know, I, I got to dump this clutch. Do I dump it like I just got done eating Taco Bell all night with the club? Or do I dump it, you know, just, just like I normally would on the ZX? I, I, I can't figure that part out. Plus, this clutch is really weird. I need to put a one-finger clutch on it like all my other bikes. All right, let's try it again. Yeah, came up a little bit. That was like a bitch wheelie. Woo! Nothing there either. This is going to be really hard. Let's try a couple more. Fuck it. I don't think it's going to happen. Like, I'm in first gear, too. Going slow. 10 miles an hour. Yeah, I just, I don't, I don't think it's going to happen. <laughs> I, just, I just don't think it'll work. I don't know. If, if anybody else out there can fucking do it, then uh, just let me know. I wonder if she'll fucking do a rolling burnout. Oh! <laughs> nope, with the front tire wheel. <laughs> this thing ain't got no fucking power, does it? Let's see. Let's try this again. Yeah, I don't know, man. I just, I don't think it's going to work for me. What we need to do is just go ahead and sell this one already and buy a diamond. Ah, oh, man, it feels so good out. Sun's out with overcast. It's not too bright, not too windy, but it is windy. It's Oklahoma. I mean, fuck it always is here, no matter what. Ah. The only thing I'm missing is Del Taco. But we ain't got no fucking Del Tacos around here. Ugh. And the closest one's in Norman, like, 25, 30 minutes away. You know, I, I, I want a taco and a burrito, man, so bad. But I don't think it's worth the 30 minute drive. It's just, it's just, I just, it just ain't worth it. I got things to do. So anyways, you guys, what, what, what'd you think? What'd you think? You know what I mean? Be honest. What, t tell me what you thought of the new bike, you know, the cruiser. Let me know, let me know in, the, in those comments below. I'd appreciate, you know, voicing your opinion so I can laugh at it or tell you to fuck off or agree with you. I'd, I'd, I'd really like to do that. Ah, it sounds so good, man. It's like, I love the way this sounds. I love the way it rides. I can actually ride and cruise and haul ass on this thing, and it's so comfortable. Like, so comfortable. I can take a nap on this bitch. Like, but then I'd be like dead because I'd hit somebody. But I really could, man. You, you can even lean back on this bitch, put your feet up. Ah, I put it on cruise control and just... Oh, shit. I can see myself in my mirror. I'm not used to having mirrors. Where am I going? I don't even know. I kind of want a snow cone. What I do need to do is go to Home Depot because me, while we were riding, some shit fell off. And I know what you're going to say. <laughs> Stupid fucking Harley. Uh, 
Uh, Holly's always break. Uh, Holly's a piece of shit. Uh, well, it, yeah, that might be true, but they're still fun, and they look good. So go fuck yourself. But on on this custom exhaust here, I've been hearing this rattling noise for a little bit, and I looked at it today and realized that the bolts came off of the uh, where the exhaust head thing goes into the header or whatever. I, I'm not a mechanic. I don't fucking know. But where the exhaust connects to the fucking engine or wherever. Okay. There's there's two little two little nuts that came off. All right. And I need to get some nuts and put them back in. So if anybody's got some spare nuts out there that wants to send them to me, go ahead and put them in your, uh, you know, in an envelope. Uh, make sure you bubble wrap them because I know, you know, mailing your nuts out is going to hurt. Uh, and send it to P.O. Box 8094, and that's Oklahoma City, Oklahoma, 73153. And go ahead and address that to Cali Brock. Here's my nuts. And I'll be really grateful. So, uh, yeah, I'm going to, I'm going to 7-Eleven real quick because I need a Slurpee. Why do I need a Slurpee? Because it's so fucking hot. And they just redid this whole 7-Eleven, dude, and it looks nice. They actually upgraded for the first time ever. Oh, look, we got some fucking motorcyclist people at the driving school, faggots. Learn how to ride. Just kidding. Obviously, you got there somehow. Oh, yeah. You guys, if you guys want to win a $100 gift card, go ahead and text Cinco de Mayo to 31996, okay? That's a, a ad promotion for Corona Extra. Go ahead and uh, slide me in that couple hundred dollars for uh, and, you know shouting you out right there, Corona. I really appreciate it. <gasps> Dill pickle flavored fucking chips, nasty. Oh my god, trolling dirty would be in heaven right now. She's like three foot tall. Oh my god, I gotta be quiet. I gotta whisper it. it can't be loud. <sighs> Oh, yeah, get that cherry limeade, bro. Oh, yeah. Oh, no. Oh, this is horrible. I don't even have my fucking wallet on me. Oh, boomer. Hi. Shit, what am I going to do? Okay, you know what? <laughs> I'm going to set that right there. And I'll be back in just a minute. It's going to be so weird. I just straight up walked in here to fill up an icy and then walked back out. <laughs> Without kidding. Oh, I feel like such a bum right now. Yep. There you go, guys. Yeah, there's, there's my good deed for, for filling up a Slurpee and uh, not buying it. Such a dick move. And I left my phone out here. What the fuck am I doing? I wonder if I even brought my wallet and it just fell out of my pocket. No one will ever know until I go get it and come back. All right, you guys, I'm getting the fuck out of here, dude. I gotta go back to the house, get my wallet, and go back and pay for that shit. I feel like such a fucking loser right now. <laughs> Oh, well, it happens. Anyway, I hope you enjoyed this video, guys. If you did, leave it that thumbs up. If you didn't, go ahead and leave it that thumbs down. Either way works for me. It's getting viewed. <laughs> so, if you're new to the channel, thank you for uh, watching. Go ahead and subscribe. Hit that bell notification. You'll stay up to date with all my new vids coming out. Or you won't because YouTube fucking sucks. And they never, ever, ever fucking tell anybody videos come out. And they fucking unsubscribe your fucking subs for no reason without them knowing all the time. So yeah, I just appreciate whoever's there watching. Anyway, guys, I'm out this motherfucker. I'll see you on the next video. Hope you have a good day, and peace the fuck out. It's a long way home At the end of the road I'll be paving my own way To the top, I'll be here to stay So take my name, remember this face Keep the change and have a nice day And live for the moment, not by the past Home and live each day like it's the last Oh my yeah. life I could have fit in my Oh, you threw it away. Oh, Dude, I, I came down and I forgot my wallet. I had to haul ass back home to get it. <laughs> now nah, you're good, brother. <laughs> oh, yeah. That is true. <laughs> no, it's okay.
You too. Thank you, buddy. All right. So now, now I don't feel so bad. But I do really want to drink right now. And I can't figure out how the hell I'm going to do that, let alone where I put my damn key. Did I leave it on the fucking thing in there? You guys, this is what happens when you smoke. Mary Jamalas. Although I don't smoke those. I'm just saying. It's a possibility. Excuse me, buddy. Gonna need these. Look at that. Left them right there. <laughs> that fucking lady was staring at me all crazy. Like, who the fuck is this guy talking to? She still is. Yeah, I saw you, lady. I'm talking to myself. I'm a cray cray man. Time to get me and my Slurpee home. Ooh, Bud Light and Corona. You're going to have yourself a good day, ain't you? You're going to have a good day, huh? Always. The only time I don't need to be careful is when I got the beers. I need to get a cup holder. Ooh, here we go. Bam. Cup holder. There we go. I'll see how long it stays. Because I just need to get going. And I can pick it back up. Oh, 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 don't spill. <laughs> you got to be super careful on the downhill slopes. Oh, yeah. We got a cup holder. Yeah. Fuck yeah. Whoop, whoop. Give me a drink. Ah! You stay right there. Don't you move. 